From projects big, small, and award-winning, to declarations. We are in a climate emergency. And, and devastation. All, all eyes were on Noosa in 2019. From the Sunshine Coast where right now firefighters are in the grips of a major emergency battling to get the upper hand on this fierce fire that's ravaging Perigian Beach. One house has been destroyed, we know another home has been badly damaged and many, many more are under threat. Not one single fatality, not one single missing person. Nothing short of a miracle. With thousands of people evacuated, the community response was overwhelming. We are really rich in spirit, and uh, this is a very fine example of it. Thousands of hectares burned, thousands more were preserved in a landmark deal that also saved an important wildlife corridor. A first of its kind, the project scooped a national award. And the accolades kept coming in 2019. The community and visitors loved the new boardwalk, which scored a number of coveted awards. So it's been a fantastic opportunity professionally for myself to work on this project, uh, where we've been able to basically construct a world-class facility as the jewel in the crown for Noosa, for at least half a million people able to enjoy every year. Local businesses flourished, with Noosa claiming 11 gongs at the Sunshine Coast Business Awards. Everyone's dedicated and I think no business can really be successful without the people who work in it. And I think we all share the accolades and we all share the hardships as well. From building business to the business of building, projects big and small took shape all over Noosa. From the Botanical Gardens Shade House to the Noosa Aquatic Centre refurbishment. The major refurbishment has involved a lot of trades on site, from the roof to the deck to the emptying of the pools. The major contract is a local contractor and they're responsible for grouting in between the 50,000 tiles that are in the main pool. There's 12,000 lineal metres of grout that's been placed into that and then refilled with over 2 million litres of water. With the doors to the knack reopened, plans for one of the most talked about adventure playgrounds came to life through 3D rendering. Raising the bar, this gave hinterland locals a real glimpse of what's to come. From playgrounds to campgrounds, the Noosa North Shore facility underwent a refurb too. The Noosa North Shore campground has just had a major revamp and facelift. It's been a popular campsite for over 30 years and this $3.2 million revamp will ensure its popularity into the future. With an eye on the future, the time to take action was now. We are in a climate emergency and that active action has to be taken, otherwise global catastrophe is inevitable. Noosa became the first local council in Queensland to call for action on climate change. Noosa's 2026 target of zero emissions was on track with the rollout of more than 1,100 solar panels across council buildings. Extensive consultation delivered the new Noosa plan, which will shape the look and feel of the region for at least the next decade. The digital hub at Perigian Beach clocked up 12 months of operation and collaboration, while $10 million of historical inherited debt from de-amalgamation was paid off. It's really important to understand that that historical debt it was at a much higher interest rate than the interest rates that are available today. Setting the tone for a strong future, 179 locals took their pledge at one of five Australian citizenship ceremonies in Noosa this year. As the region continues to flourish, 2019 showed just how incredibly resilient the wonderful Noosa community truly is.